got to talk about a song about, uh, what it was, uh, I thought about one. Last month, about two months ago, yeah, we released a song, it's called Herbalist. A lot of people still ain't understand the full concept behind this song. We're going to play this song, we're going to let you introduce this song. I thought you'll find it tune for me. Um, tell us this song, how it came about. It's Right now, it's, it's been getting a lot of love on Inside Rebel Music. So, how, how the whole concept for this song came about it's a true story though because it's song like well actually yeah actually it is you know first i must say thanks to the love from the people you know mm -hmm. what i mean mm -hmm. um yeah actually it is a true story mm -hmm. you know i was coming from mayaro and they you know and the drive was a very long and tiring drive mm -hmm. you know and the only so you know or, or i should say the only thing could I really keep my company while coming through this long drive was you don't know what's going on you know you, <laughs> you don't know you know uh, yes I, I yeah you know and it's so often that you know police pass you know i don't know if they smell anything or you know then they decide to turn back and you know the draw down on me and say you know question mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. you know the thing that's mm -hmm. going you know and so, uh -huh. you know we had a little reasoning i explained to them well who i was and stuff and you know to my surprise you know they knew yeah, yeah, and right. the officers them was like, you know, delighted to know where you hey, yeah, royal dainties, yeah, thing, yeah. thing, you know. And, you know, I get a little glad, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> so, through that, through that little um, situation there, Queen, you, you went to open to paper and this is what came out? Yeah, that is what came out. Because actually, you know, you know within, the, within the whole scene, it was kind of dramatic too. Okay, You right. know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Because before they get to the point of knowing who I was, you mm -hmm. know, it's like yeah. the interrogation and... The and beaten yeah, fast. You know, you know that kind of way? Yeah. <laughs> Well, T T, for those of you who don't know the song that he's speaking about, Royal, I'm gonna give you the chance to introduce it to me. It's called Herbalist. Very, very big song. Mr. Royal, take it away now. Introduce your tune. Yeah, man, remember, say this is Mr. Royal. Yeah, remember, say this is the Herbalist brand new on Next Level of Radio 99.1. Yep. It's called the Herbalist, Mr. Royal. Very, very big song. <laughs> Mr. Royal is live in studio with a sort of brand new truck. <laughs> listen this one, listen. <laughs> now get pulled over. The music coming out from Mr. Royal. <laughs> A lot of people can have to relate to this. Coming from the air, we're smoking mice. Never thinking about police. Let me roll down the window. Turn up my radio. Smoke going through the trees. We never hear no siren while I was driving. Floating by the
is the um, the same instrumental after. Yeah. We can make the on the instrumentalist. This the same. What we are talking on it just now. Well, when you're here, it's not about you. Tell me about instrumental profile. Oh. That's the that's the that's the touch. Get the them out. What the tune is now, boy. Before you introduce the tune, let's get them a little taste in it and what's the tune now, right? <laughs> well, you don't know, you know. Uh, I mean, I was say how um um so see the sell food when they ain't doing soca, so royal had to do something, you know. Oh, I mean? uh, that was Hubelis coming up from Mr. Royal up close and personal tonight inside Rebel Music. We've got the artist in studio. We talked about his past. Talk about the uh, this tune, the Hubelis, one of the biggest songs right now. You got advice with the artist now, what's going on with the future? Any any new things? Yeah man, well, I'm working on some new tracks. I'm putting together a couple of tracks right now. Mm -hmm. You know, um, I have some of them on the CD that I brought there, you know. Nice. Um, it's, it's, it's some different kind of music though. I mean, mm -hmm. I'm still doing, you know, the party vibes kind of song mm -hmm. and, you know, for the Empress and thing, you know. Mm -hmm. But I also, you know, trying to bring it a little more real too, you know, trying mm -hmm. to see if I could step up the standard in some um, way, you know what I mean? And when you say, when you say different, um, are we looking at something out of the genre, out of reggae music? Oh no, actually it mm -hmm. is reggae music, reggae but, all right. but um, I, I, to me, I think the style and the topic kind of different from, from, from the rest, you know what I mean? All right, okay, yeah. all right, in that sense. Yeah. You have the tune line up the i all right. Well, Mr. Royal. One of his latest songs right now. You're gonna hear it right here first, right here, next 991 Rebel Music. Mr. Royal, what's the name of the track? Real. Real. Yeah. It's called Real. Coming out from Mr. Royal, listen. Sure it's free. Hey, hey, hey. Me tell you, sometimes I'm a 
Trinidad and Tobago every time, you know? And global too, you know, Royal, we, we all across the net right now. Well, yeah, to the world, to all the all world, straight to the world, man. Yeah, man, what I mean, man. Yeah. We gotta send some love going out to our Canada family, they're locked in. Also to the JA crew, they're locked in also, inspired music, big up to the team. Now, Mr. Royal, time is slowly running out, but Prophet made the switch. You looking to see Mr. Royal inside Carnival 2013? <laughs> yeah, well, actually, it was a thought. It was, it was a thought. Yeah. yeah, it was even, you know, a little like freak um, imagination. But <laughs> um, I don't know. I don't think I'm ready to really push out there as yet. You mm -hmm. know, I had to kind of like gather the vibes and the spirit because, you know, to push a soaker, mm -hmm. you know, you had to push the performance with it as mm -hmm. well. You know. Yes. Exactly. Yeah, and, and really and truly, I'm really not a big whiner, man. I had to like, you know, practice that some more yeah. before I jump out, you know yeah. what I mean? Mm. You know, but yeah, I don't have a problem with it, you mm. know? You don't have a problem with no, it? No, I, I, I'm not really against it. You always train that up from, I love the place I born and grow, you know what I mean? Mm. Yeah, man, respect them all the time, you know? Well, you know, not, not a lot of artists have that, um, that same mentality, you know, a lot of them saying, you know, it's reggae day on, they're not into this, this soca thing. I see that like you have an open mind about the whole the whole topic. Well, for my place, yeah. Mm -hmm. For my place, yeah, I could make a statement for Trinidad. No scene. You know what I mean? Yeah mm -hmm. man, I could do that for Trinidad and Tobago, you know? Mm -hmm. You know, but you know, reggae is really what I love, you know, it as I explained love. that. Yeah. You know, first and not most, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah but you know, for Trinidad I mean, yeah man. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Royal in studio, select the I4. Father Kern, the rebel boys, I4. We're gonna take a pause when we get back, squeeze off some tune. Mr. Royal is in studio. We're gonna see if we can close off the interview after we get back. I'm squeezing some phone calls also. All the fans wanna get in touch with our Mr. Royal. So, all that and so much more inside Rebel Music. We take a pause and come back around so much more. 